Hey guys, it's December 2021, it's freezing here in London and I still haven't posted the video about our summer three-day bikepacking trip along the coast of the UK purely because I didn't have time to edit it. So I asked my friend to help me with the edit and I really like how it turned out. I hope you'll like it too. As you can see, I'm in the train and we are off for a three-day bikepacking trip with my friends, Dennis and Eugene. And let me show you how many bikes we have in the train. It's crazy. Uh, London on Saturday morning, the whole train is just packed with bike packers. And also there. And the whole train is like that. We're at the start point in Winchester. Day one. Let's go. Let's do it. Are you yeah. still searching for the route? one of my sleepers. Luckily Dennis spotted it. Now they can be together again. Thank you Dennis. <laughs> you know mm. Sometimes we have to walk. Still enjoying the ride? Yes I Georgia. am. It's a great ride. <laughs> Going well, a lot of gravel, but I've been enjoying it. First stop, we've just gone through the South Downways. More off-road, more off-road. <laughs> yeah, you guys can't get enough, right? Is it, is it now road ahead? We're still going gravel. I guess not, none of us is prepared for gravel today. But when you, it would come. I think I think uh, here we have two options. Okay, I Carry choose road. <laughs> <laughs> Carry on or they switch to the uh, route number one, yeah. which is like more road gravel ish kind of thing. Ish. That's hot. Ooh. I'm Eugene can't, cy can't cycle <laughs> anymore. Home. Eugene was our route designer. So we relied on him, we wow, believed him. Yeah. Eugene, how is gravel cycling on 28mm road tires going? Surprisingly okay. No wild punctures, not very smooth, but you know, getting there. That's impressive. Weird sounds yeah, coming from gravel, Eugene. Gravel is uh, taking the best out of me. <laughs> Second and third day would be mostly a road, so... Oh well. We survive, Hopefully, we survive by then, yeah. <laughs> we have plan B. Yeah. It's a uh, Eugene and Kamut collaboration. Okay. It was really inspiring when I planned it and I kicked it gravel really and it said, Eugene, you just plant a gravel ride. <laughs> <laughs> Two hours later. Anyone fancy cycling? <laughs> Not today.
Dennis, yeah. are you glad to be back to the road? Big times, yeah. With the newly rebuilt Linsky, full upgrades, compatible for off-road. <laughs> yeah, now ready to conquer more. Yeah, another part of England. Yeah, and we are cycling on the tarmac, right? <laughs> yeah, a little bit of everything. British seaside. British summer. British summer. <laughs> oh. 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 Sent from uh, Sahara Desert, specially brought. It's actually quite warm. Another five kilometers walk, and we'll manage to get a swim. I'll just pretend that uh, I jumped into the water. Shopping in waitress. Yeah, fully stocked. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Why do you even need to bring your own food? Indeed. Because, yeah. yeah, supermarkets on the way. Well, <laughs> delicious pancakes from Moria. It's too too easy camping these days, yeah. <laughs> to book the campsite for the first night so we were trying to find a piece of land where we can put our tents and we couldn't but we were very lucky that some lovely people allowed us to put our tents just in front of their house on a loan just look at that they, they also gave us beer yeah so nice look at that this is our um, dinner table. Yeah, on the fresh grass. Gazpacho. To begin uh, with, there's baguette, pizza. bananas for tomorrow, I guess. Breakfast. This is beer and a bottle of wine from. Well, <laughs> the this, these people we are staying at, <laughs> like unbelievable. They really like uh, and uh, Dennis is cooking some ravioli. Oh wow! <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> Master chef. Look at this magic. It becomes red and you will see wow. MSR logo on it. It's a kind of cool thing that they created. Yeah. I was dreaming about it for the last three hours. Cheers. Cheers. See you guys enjoying the ride. First thing in the morning. Yes. I see smiles on your face.
A bit raining today. Second half of the day, still 60 miles to go. Enjoying great weather in, in England. We are clearly in England. This is a lovely coast, all right? Yeah, the best beaches in the world. Best views as well. <laughs> Got on gravel under the rain. Most of us enjoying gravel is Eugen. And everything. He's like. He's got lots of porridge. I need a magic stick. second half of the day was horrible it was raining for what five hours <laughs> under the rain we thought it would never stop but we finally got to the camping site yep. and it's not raining never been happy. and they have hot showers yeah can't wish for anything more than a hot shower right now Dinner finishing. Steak, truffle ravioli. Yeah, and uh, we have the best soup on the planet. Yeah. <coughs> Made by the chef working in Hirons. <laughs> <laughs> Every morning starts with brushing your teeth and brushing your bike, especially when you have a close bike. Clean bike is a fast bike. Hello. The only man who, who is uh, fresh in our band. Yeah, we need some refreshment. <laughs> <laughs> Third day was really tough. 150 kilometers with 1800 elevation gain. Not as tough as the second one though, at least it wasn't raining, the weather was really nice, so we were lucky. Woo! Wow, that was a hell of a trip and really good memories. If you want to see the gear that I used on that bikepacking trip, there is a video on my channel and I'll leave the link above. Let me know in the comments down below whether you want to see more videos like that on my channel. And as always, please like, subscribe, share, I really appreciate it. And happy holidays everyone!